Mark, I think we may have an argument. What? Plead insane. Too much evidence is against you if you plead innocent, and you'll go to jail. What happens to me if I plead insane? Not much. You'll go to a mental health facility until you're cured. Then you'll probably be let off. What if I'm tested and proof sane? I'll clear that aspect of the argument. Do you, Sue McConnell, agree that you will agree to turn over the necessary information in exchange for the removal of your sentence, manslaughter? Susan McConnell? Yes. Do you, David Ruggles, plead innocent or guilty? Guilty. Do you, Jeff Garrett, plead innocent or guilty? Guilty. Do you, Betsy Klein, plead innocent or guilty? This is ridiculous. My daughter would never. Guilty. Mark Guinea, do you plead innocent, guilty, or other to the following charges? First degree murder, second degree murder, and attempted murder. Insane? 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 No, no, he's perfectly sane. I beg to differ. According to Mark's medical record and history, Mark shows many side schizophrenia, such as voices in his head and his prejudice against certain eye colors. But Mark never- He's lies! He's lies! Evil! Evil! Don't trust the lies! It's true, Mark's sane. Not the blue tube! Your honor, Mark is clearly, truly, very- But he's sane! She's right, Mark's completely sane. Your honor, clearly these individuals don't understand what is going- But I swear, he was sane! Order in the court! I pronounce Mark Kenny insane. He'll spend six months at a mental hospital before being returned to close watch with his family. Unless he's too mentally ill to be released. Yes, I'm down on my luck. Well, I'm down on my luck. And I'm hiding in Honduras. I'm a desperate man. Send lawyers, guns, and money.